Hello, Raising Cane readers. Thank you so much for following along and joining us. I'm looking forward to blogging on Friday. We're on a huge roll with the campaign. As some of you may have heard, we had quite a debate with Congressman Good last week in Charlottesville, and even in his home county of Franklin, we've gotten a big boost out of it. People can't believe uh, that he gave answers like the one on health care, saying that there's nothing wrong with the American health care system. If anything screams, I'm out of touch with what's going on with the American people, it's that. But more importantly, uh, we've got Senator Obama coming to the district for the first time uh, since becoming the presumptive nominee in Martinsville. We're going to be together tomorrow talking about the most important thing in our district, jobs. Jobs and economic relief to the middle class and working families is the key to our area. Because as excited as I am about this campaign, it is painful to go around this district and hear story after story of people who are getting crushed by this economy crushed by the cost of health care, crushed by the price of the pump. I was volunteering this morning with this big sisters program in Danville, and this nine-year-old girl named Precious turned to me and said, why aren't they doing anything about the price of gas? When even our children know that our politicians are failing us, we know something needs to change. We're doing that in this campaign. That's why we're picking up so much momentum. That's why we're going to win this thing. That's why we're going to see Obama, Warner, and Perriello all coming through at the end of the day. We're excited to talk more on Friday. I'm looking forward to the conversation, and I'm looking forward to all of you finding your way to the district to help us out here this fall.